She was Thailand's youngest prime minister and the first woman to hold the office, a successful businesswoman from a powerful political dynasty. But since she came to power in 2011, her leadership's been crippled by civil conflict and a protracted campaign of protests to topple her. Thailand's been gripped by political unrest since 2006 when her billionaire brother Thaksin was deposed after a military coup. He now lives in exile, convicted of abuse of power and corruption. Those opposing Yingluck accuse her of acting as her brother's puppet. The family's political power base is among Thailand's rural poor, the so-called red shirt movement. They see the institutions of power and the country's urban elite, including the courts, as prejudiced against them. In November of 2013, street clashes became more violent. More than 20 people were killed. Ying Luck called fresh elections for February to shore up her legitimacy, but they were annulled and rescheduled for this July. Her removal from office will create a dangerous political vacuum, which is likely to see more protests on the streets and will do little to end Thailand's ongoing political turmoil. Veronica Pedroza, Al Jazeera, Bangkok.